This is breaking news. Jennifer Lopez walks out of autograph signing after fan asked question about her ex Diddy. Jennifer Lopez was not impressed when she was asked about her disgraced ex-boyfriend seeing Diddy Combs at a fan autograph signing in LA. Jennifer Lopez was not impressed when she was asked about her disgraced ex-boyfriend seeing Diddy Combs at a fan autograph signing in LA. The US singer had just attended a special screening and queue and a session for her new movie Unstoppable at the OFI Fest when she was hit with a personal question at the autograph signing outside the TCL Chinese Theater. In footage from the event, Lopez could be seen happily stopping to sign autographs for fans. But one fan overstepped and wanted to hear her thoughts on the shock claims made against her ex Diddy, who is currently behind bars on charges of racketeering and sex trafficking. J Lo, do you have any comments about Diddy and the allegations? The fan asked. The question appeared to irritate Lopez and the 55-year-old abruptly stopped signing autographs and stormed off with her entourage as some fans begged her not to leave. The Atlas star started dating Diddy in 1999 after meeting on the set of the music video for her debut single, If You Had My Love. They went on to have a highly publicized romance for two years, during which they were engulfed by cheating scandals and were even involved in a nightclub shooting that saw them both arrested. However, the charges were quickly dropped against the duo. They would call it quits in 2001. Before Lopez's relationship with the rap mogul, she was married to Ojani No, who claimed last week that Diddy played a significant role in the couple's divorce. The pair were married for less than one year, from February 1997 to January 1998. And according to Noah, part of that divorce was Diddy's fault. Speaking on the Spanish-language talk show Despierta America, No said the marriage started to crumble when Lopez began working with Combs in New York on her debut album, On the Six. Meanwhile, No remained in Los Angeles, working at the singer's then-restaurant, Madri's in Pasadena. There, in that distance, in that separation, was where the deception started, he said. Last month, Combs was arrested on charges of federal racketeering, sex trafficking, and transportation to engage in prostitution. The rapper has pleaded not guilty to all the charges and remains in jail at Brooklyn's Metropolitan Detention Center until his trial begins in May 2025.